Championship Wrestling Club. She is wrestling Rose Cassiopa, Rose Cassiope in the blue. Hana and Hoga Wrestling Club. Underhook and good head position. Rose Cassiope, she gets to a double on the edge. One for the step out, makes it 1-0. Slide by for Cassiope, gets around behind. She may be thinking about going big. Hayes still in quad pod, now knees touch. It's three to one. Cassiope looking for a high gut. It's not gonna go. Hayes drops it on a double. How are they going to call it? Four offered, four confirmed, and it is four to three. Hayes now with the lead. Minute 45, good level change there from Cassiope. She got Hayes to bite on it. Cassiope drops to a single. Trying to come up with it. Hayes still has the wrist. Now Cassiope gets the lock. They're going to go out of bounds. One offered, two offered, and just going to be one confirmed. Hayes still with criteria on the four pointer. Cassiope looks for a shot. Hayes looking for a crotch lift. No exposure yet. Cassiope trying to sink those hips, glue them to the ground. Shot attempt there from Hayes, 40 to go in the first. Cassiope looking to stuff the head. Head pinch, snaps Hayes. Hayes collects that leg a little bit, so action gonna stop, 28 to go in the first. Underhook for Cassiope. Cassiope, you're a runner out of bounds. Oh no, Hayes turns. Cassiope steps out and at the buzzer, Hayes with the point. Oh, it's not at the buzzer. It's the break. It should be the break. Yeah, that was at the buzzer. Then I got confused because the clock was running, but. That's the 30-second uh, clock in between periods. Five four Hayes. She has the most recent point and the four pointer. So if this does get tied up, she's got criteria. Cassiope looks head pinch and she gets it. Four offered, four confirmed. Eight five. Rose Cassiope takes the lead and she's still got it locked up. One on the step out, offered and confirmed. So it's nine to four.
Hayes needs to create some offense, two on one. Now Hayes running forward, Cassiope with that underhook, fighting wrists, and Cassiope drops to a double, now switches single. Hayes collecting that ankle underneath, and now the foot. She may look for a turn here, Cassiope improves her position, and we're gonna come back to our feet with two minutes to go. Rose Cassiope trailing a lot of this match, but now with a 9-5 lead. Cassiope looks for another shot, head outside. And lat whip attempt for Hayes. Now Hayes trying to get on top. Cassiope still has that leg. Shot attempt for Cassiope. And on that shot, trying to go ahead outside. Hayes, cross face and an ankle, near side ankle. Cassiope elevates, comes up. And Latwift attempt again. Four offered for Hayes. Four confirmed for Hayes. And then Cassiope, I believe, going to get two on the gut wrench. Although no such two has been called. Cassiope's corner may think about challenging. It looked like there was a gut wrench to me. Hayes leads. She has two four-point moves. Minute six to go. Fifty-five seconds to go. Hayes gets around behind. Tries to go big. Cassiope stuffs her. What are they going to call? Two blue offered, two red offered, and two blue confirmed. So Cassiope leads 11 to 9. Thirty-five seconds left. Hayes wanted the brick from the corner. She asked Geneva Gray, who said, "No, you're going to take her down. That's how you're going to win this." Probably a good no challenge anyway. Although it was very close. Snap for Hayes. Cassiope. Collar tie. Not giving Hayes much space. Hayes. Dives on a shot, Cassiope looking chest wrap. Hayes in decent position, five seconds to go. Cassiope now putting weight on with that chest wrap. Hayes running forward and time expires. Rose Cassiope in a 20 point barn burner gets the win and she will advance to the best of three finals tomorrow. That's gonna do it for the semifinals. We got best of three action tomorrow, and then U17 and U23 early rounds also start tomorrow. It's gonna be a whole lot of fun. Well,